Hey guys, how are you doing? In this video, I'm going to show you how to do a bent over row with the bar on your fusion motion. So this exercise is a very good exercise to train your upper back, but not only does this train your upper back, in the beginning when you start off with this exercise, you might notice your lower back building up a lot of tension during this exercise. So not only is it training the upper, but also your lower back. It's completely normal if you feel your lower back muscles burn during this exercise. So we're going to go straight into it and I'm going to not stand up completely simply because of the tension on the bands that are running all the way to the other side underneath this board, okay? Because if I were to stand up now, it would be really tough. So we're going to just stay down here, which is the position we want to be in for this exercise. Later, I'll show you how to do it from the side and you'll see a bit more information. So first thing I want to do is tuck my elbows back and pull my shoulders back. My knees are not locked out, they're nice and soft and I'm keeping my back as straight as possible. Keep your neck nice and straight and you're simply going to pull the bar to your diaphragm and come down nice and slowly. What I am focusing on is to not shrug, all right? At the top of the repetition, I'm really focusing on pulling my shoulder blades together, okay? Very important for this exercise is to focus on the movement and what you feel during this movement, okay? So lots of people just do the movement and get it over and done with. You really want to focus on pulling those shoulder blades together and contract the muscle to get the most out of it. So for the side view, you can see that my back is nice and flat and my knees are not completely straight, okay? So I'm going to tuck my elbows in, I'm going to pull, squeeze my shoulder blades together, come down nice and slowly. Up fast, squeezing my shoulder blades together, nice and slowly down. So this exercise, I've chosen the black bands in the beginning for a reason, simply because your back and your upper back is a very strong muscle. If you want to make this any tougher, I could recommend for you to combine the red and the black bands together. But my favorite is to just pull it up, squeeze and hold it in that position from anywhere to two to five seconds before you go back down. You'll notice that will change the intensity or the difficulty of this exercise a lot. So give this a go. If you have any questions, just comment down below and we'll get back to you as soon as possible. Good luck.